Hey y'all, Evan with Slice's Concession. Does your food service restaurant or bar want to get in the daiquiri business? All around the U.S. there are many different folks that are selling daiquiris, from drive through daiquiri shops in the American South to other places that want to add on daiquiris in kind of a Caribbean kind of style thing. Daiquiris are fun, profitable, and people love them. Now, the problem is, is that so many daiquiri machines are super tiny volume and they're just not made to really do a restaurant that's really kicking out and making tons of money. And that's where the Taylor 342 comes in. The size of these machines means that you can really crank out the product at a consistent temperature or a consistent viscosity, excuse me. So one of the things that we like about these is that the has 1.75 gallons and two hoppers and about five gallons of product to mix. This machine does about 12 gallons of finished product per hour per side. Uh, so you really can't get that from a lot of the smaller countertop um, items. You just can't get that much volume out there. And many times you need that much volume, especially if you're doing a lot of to-goes uh, and, you're, and you're really having a high ticket mount. So if you're looking to get in the daiquiri business, you really got to consider the Taylor 342 because you can batch all of your mixes ahead of time, which means you, the owner or manager, can make sure that the alcohol pour and cost is exact. You do it in the morning. You put it in the hoppers, you keep the leftover amounts in a cambro in the fridge, and then you can just keep adding to the hopper, and every time you pull the handle, it keeps freezing mix. Mix comes down from the refrigerator hopper into the barrel, so you can keep on making them. So let's check it out, what looks like this layered daiquiri. I got a blueberry daiquiri, and then I also have this really awesome uh, pineapple daiquiri here. And so we're going to take the Taylor 342, turn it back on, Get that nice blue color. Really cool kind of hurricane look. Get that red and top it off with our pina colada. And so, right there, I made a daiquiri faster than you can pour a daiquiri, faster than you can do a grinding ice version daiquiri. In under seven seconds, you have an item that can easily sell for $10, 12 due to the layered look. If this was just one flavor, the customer wouldn't want to pay as much. But because of this layered look, you get a much higher cost that you can charge. So let's go on back and let's start a picture of daiquiris. Can your machine do a picture of daiquiri in five seconds or less? I doubt it. That's how great the Taylor 342 is. So while we're doing that, let's keep on selling some more. There you go, back-to-back -back sales of your daiquiri. So let's talk about some costing. You know, you could probably sell this, depending on your market, anywhere from eight to $12. So let's say you're just selling it for eight, probably lower than you can get. With alcohol, your cost is probably $1.50, profit margin is $6.50 there. There's a lot of room there. How you could spice this up, you could add some toppings on top, you could have a funky straw, you could have fresh ground nutmeg, pineapple, and then your price could even increase. So if you want to get in the daiquiri business, you got to make sure you start with a machine that's large enough to actually meet your needs. So if you don't know, frozen drinks and frozen alcoholic drinks have some of the highest uh, margins in the frozen dessert world, sometimes even higher than soft serve and premium batch ice cream. So today we're going to kind of talk about margaritas, slushies, and daiquiris. So let's say your sales price is $8 for a 16 ounce. Your costs with an alcohol based of a daiquiri or a margarita may be around $1.50. Uh, profit margin at 650. So if you sell 200 a day, you're looking at 474 thousand dollars, 500 profit in a year. Uh, so something to consider right there. Other thing too is let's say you're selling a margarita at five dollars and you're into smaller glass, and then your cost is 80 cents. Profit is about four dollars and twenty. If you sell 40 a day, that's 61 thousand dollars in profit a year. So. Frozen drinks, be they alcoholic or not alcoholic, definitely have a lot of margin in them. Some other reasons why frozen drink machines are better than maybe an ice blended margarita is the mouthfeel. So that you get a much smoother mouthfeel and a better crystal feeling of the, of the product when you're actually using a frozen beverage machine versus a blender. Also, let's talk about ticket times. You can serve back-to-back -back flavors and keep going than having your employees having to blend the ice and pour and etc. And because the manager or the owner can actually be making the bases that go in these hoppers, you can control the alcohol before it goes in. So 
One thing that you can do is that if you're the owner operator, you actually make all your batches ahead of time with the alcohol and the, and the flavorings in there and you just dump it in so you don't have to worry about your employees over pouring or your pour costs going up. Kind of a nice thing to think about. Now, let's kind of check it out. We have, you know, you can see these kind of ubiquitous cups all around and when you actually have a machine that's large enough to fill these, like the Taylor 342 where you have such large freezing cylinders, it's kind of cool. So you can actually sit here and you can and then top it off. And then right there and then, that just sells itself. So you can check out how you can have these to-go cups. And if you do have a bar, you can obviously be having people walk around with your brand on there. That's a real powerful thing to have. So if you have any questions about ice cream machines, frozen drink machines, Rose, margaritas, daiquiri, high-end soft serve, vegan soft serve, gelato, pasteurizers, you name it. If you're looking to get into the frozen dessert business, we can do a few things for you. Connect you with the right machine at the right price and with the right kind of purveyors of all the other ingredients you need. If you have any questions, please see us at www.slicesconcession.com and feel free to call us.